Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make E to punch this tree, and whenever you um, cut it down, you get the wood. So now I got this tool, um, which is called wood. So it does respawn, and I'm going to show you how to make that in like minutes. So now let's go and see how to make that. Okay, so this might be simple, more simpler than what you actually think. You actually only need a, a tool. And this tool must be called wood with a capital W. You you can change the name, but you need to change uh, the name in the script too. So this wood um, tool has um, um, a handle, which is uh, a part that I created. I can make it bigger, but I'm not going to. And you need to name it handle. So H-A-N-D-L-E with the H capital. And then make whenever you make this, Put it into the replicated storage, and then you need um, a model tree. So not a model like uh, from Blender, uh, just a model. Just just put put two parts, and you can make um, the the model. So we have this uh, leaves now, but we're not we don't really care about it. Just because the tree would really look so um, not a tree. So yeah. So the wood over here. We have it. So inside of this wood, we need to put two stuff. First, put a proximity promote, and this will make it whenever you come near it. You need to press E. So the hold duration equal to five. I put it to five, and you can change it. If the keyboard key code is equal to E. You can change it. So I'm I'm not going to change it actually, but now you need to pr put a script into the proximity promote. And now let's edit the script, okay? So, we need to make a variable. A variable about the wood tool in the replicated storage. Okay? So name it, uh, just, you can put the script in the description. But if you want to know what the script does, then you can actually take it. So, so you can actually see this. So, script.parent.triggered. So, this makes it whenever you hold E and you trigger the, the proximity promote, it will actually do uh, make an event. So this is an event, and then uh, just write this, okay? And then over here, we sometimes don't write anything in here, right? Yeah, but today we're going to be um, writing in here P L R with a P that is capital, and then we want to make a, a variable inside of this event. So local backpack equal to player or P L R. Um, colon wait for uh, child backpack so the player's backpack the players the player himself who actually triggered the, the event so then we want to actually clone it because if we don't clone it there will not be more than one tool so to tool uh, colon uh, clone then two brackets the parent equal to backpack so we clone the tool, then we put it into the player's backpack. We wait 0.1 seconds, and then the tree goes into the replicated storage. So script of parent, the parent, the parent, the parent equal to game dot replicated storage. Wait five seconds, and script of parent, the parent, the parent, the parent uh, equal to game dot workspace. So this wait five is how much time the the players will need to wait until the tree grows again and they can get more wood okay so you need to put it into the workspace because it wouldn't really go into the workspace players can't get the wood after that so it's actually that simple 10 lines we can maybe make it uh, equal to like to 9 but that's more clean so yeah only 10 lines to make a tree that can get uh, punched and just cut in half um, I tried to make an axe, but it did not work. Maybe you guys can make one, and just say in the comments if you may, um, if you actually this actually helped. And yeah, see you guys in the next video. Have a great day, and if we actually hit five likes, I will actually uh, give the model in the description. So yeah, see you guys in the next video, and have a great day. Yeah.